The Urbana Pops Orchestra is celebrating its 15th season with a free concert. And here now with me on the CI stage with all the details are Tamara Gingold and Stephen Larson. Welcome. Hello. Hello. Yeah, absolutely. Before we get into your big event, uh, tell us about your organization. I mean, 15 years, that's quite the milestone. And you guys offer a very unique um, opportunity for music lovers of all kinds. Mm -hmm. We offer free concerts, uh, which is a, a mix of light classics and popular music. Uh, and then we're also a unique organization in that we're a professional orchestra that reserves seats for talented students to play alongside the seasoned professionals. That's incredible because I imagine that just opens up the doors of the future for these young students to actually see themselves in that position, playing with a professional mm -hmm. orchestra, and probably even getting a chance to talk with the other professional musicians about their careers. Oh, absolutely. Well, well I'm the educational coordinator, and it's, it's really been an amazing experience because you have students from the surrounding areas. Um, I'm the Urbana High School Orchestra Director, so of course we seek out Urbana students, Urbana High School students first. Uh, but we have students from uni and Champaign, and they all come together. Some of them have been getting lessons since they were, you know, three years old. Others have never had lessons, but they're all so hardworking. And it's really an experience that they get to have, having a professional sit next to them and getting that professional advice and, and being in a real rehearsal. There's nothing music. quite like that, getting to be in the environment in that way that is so immersive. Let's talk about the big summer event you guys have coming up. It's Rags to Rhapsody. It's June 15th at 7 p.m. and it's free. It is free. Mm -hmm. It's at Urbana High School in the auditorium. Uh, so Rags to Rhapsody, I was inspired uh, to combine those two because we are performing uh, Rhapsody in Blue by Gershwin. Uh, that's actually the 100th anniversary of that piece. And the soloist is Urbana High School student Kavi Patel. Um, he's absolutely thrilling when he plays it. I saw him play it uh, a few months ago. And then also we're joined by Urbana Park District's production of Oliver, so that's the rags part. Okay. And then combining those two, we are playing some songs from the, the musical uh, Ragtime. And then we are playing the, the music to a silent film called One Week. The Buster Keaton film. It is the Buster mm -hmm. Keaton film. And it, I saw it without music, and it was hilarious. And then with music, it just, you don't even forget that it's a silent film because it's so exciting, and there's surprises throughout the whole show. Um, it's, it's been a blast preparing for that. That is so cool, and I love that you guys are going back into film history yes. with this and tying that medium together with music because those silent films, a lot of times, that's how they were originally presented, where mm. you had live music accompanying the silent film. I actually got to see a performance in L.A. one time, and it is just such a different experience that most people don't get to experience these days when you see this, this visual medium accompanied by live music. There's nothing Nothing quite like it. Absolutely. Um, what has been just some of the the response that you've received from the community as you guys put on these different shows, and what, what's been the feedback over the past 15 years? We're really getting to see live music performed uh, by a wide range of ages of, of people, and the, the students really enjoy getting to play the um, the big kid arrangements. It, we don't do we don't do watered down um, learning editions. We do the, the real Rhapsody in Blue. We're really renting the music to ragtime, and it, it's quite a challenge so um, we but it forces them to step up oh, yes it forces them to meet the challenge right mm -hmm. that's amazing now details where can people get information about how to attend and do you need to have a ticket in hand or you just you show just, up you show, show up, up at, at about 7 p.m. a little bit early um, at Urbana High School on Saturday June 15th um, you can find information at our website urbanapops.org and we're also on Facebook uh, we have information there as well. Awesome. Well, and we'll also make sure to get everybody connected to the details on this upcoming free concert on our website. Just head over to CILiving.tv after today's show.